Hey guys, so I'm going to be printing a Wolverine hand slash arm stand um, from Deadpool 3. But this print right here, this part, is going to need some supports. So I was looking up online and looking at what supports would be best to use. Because I really haven't done too much with supports. Um, so I saw some. I'm going to see if it works well. And I kind of made some tweaks myself. So I'm going to be using Auto Tree. I'm going to go 20 degree angles. Um, build plate only. Remove small overhangs. If you go down here, support wall loops, I'm changing to two. Top interface layers, I'm going to three. Top interface spacing, I'm going to zero. And then branch angle is going to be 60. Okay. Um, so that's what I'm going to be running at. I'm going to see if it is good. I'm going to get this going in the print, and I will get back to you guys in a second and show you if the supports break way easy or not. Sorry, just before I do that, I just wanted to show you what it looks like when you slice it, and it shows the supports. So the thumb here is not going to have any support on it, which makes me a little bit nervous, but not, not too much. Um, if it doesn't come out great, it's only, you know, $2 in four hours, so, but... Uh, all the other fingers have supports on it, and then right here on the claws, they also have supports. So, like I said, I'm going to get this going, and I'll come back when I have this hand, and I'll show you if the settings work for the Wolverine hand build. Stick around. All right, so overall the print came out pretty good. Um, I'm gonna remove the supports right now to show you how easy they pop off, but it came out very good, very clean. So here we go, pop off the supports. And they break away easy and they all come off together. Um, I did break off the other side before the video got taken, but I can't say enough good things about the support settings. So if you want to go back and check out my support settings, give them a try. I've never really tweaked any support settings other than just setting the auto tree supports on. Um, this is my first time really messing with them. But like I said, the overhangs came out pretty good. There's still some overhangs, um, but that's expected with FDM. But these are solid print settings. So like the video and subscribe. Thanks. I'm Queso Builds.